Remember, guys, obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. is now underway. All the talk is done. It is simply time to fight. Good clean shot returning fire. Well done by Manny Pacquiao. Nice work. Great technique. The combo lands. Nice block by Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao's rocked by a huge hook to the head. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. Teddy, talk to me about this matchup from a defensive side of the game. When you have huge right hand comes crashing home. Wow, is he defensively sound? Wow, stunned moments ago, but now somehow, some way, surviving well. You know, Joe, I had a fighter once that got dropped in a round. And he wasn't doing real good up to that point. After that, he fought better. He boxed better, he fought better defensively. And when the fight was over, I said, good job. You know, he whispered to me. He whispered, did I get knocked out? Yeah, he did. Oh. He didn't know what had happened. I realized then he was fighting on instinct the rest of the night. Amazing story. Phenomenal pace being set here. They are burning it up early on. Let's find out who's in better shape. We're gonna see. A well-placed left hand up top. Back to the head he goes. Here's a moment here as you see the step-back counterpunch where you realize this is the sweet science, not just some raw savagery swinging out there. Look at the little subtleties here, Joe. What he does is he forces them into a position to stop the punch. And then when he stops, steps back, makes a miss, and comes right back. End of the round here, round that saw a lot of action. The kind of round that fans pay to be here to see. Well, these are TV-friendly fighters, and we figured that coming in. There he is zoning in, the old one-two. Oh, Teddy, worst case scenario, a cut has now opened up above his eyes. Yeah, and the bleeding, of course, the worst case scenario for a reason, as you said, Joe, because the blood can run into the eye and tear the vision. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Oh, and they decide to trade there. Jabbing a straight by Manny Pacquiao. That is just supreme skill by Manny Pacquiao there. He had the block on one end, counters back, and scores on his own. He missed that uppercut. Combo lands to the head. Strike after catching one by Manny Pacquiao. Good looking counter punch. Pacquiao's coming up big here early on in the fight because he just showed his opponent, hey, listen, you got to be careful. I can counter punch you. No better way to slow down your opponent. You know, we know the other way you slow him down. You hit him right on the chin and you make him say, hey, I don't want to walk in. But when you make a miss and you counter, that slows him down too. He saw the uppercut, he took advantage, throwing it out there. Pacquiao showing that he's got some defense of his own. He got away from that punch. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Good looking counter punch. Right back to the work up top. Pacquiao on the mark with that right hand. And we come to the end of round number two. Pacquiao's good, clean, and effective punching damaged his opponent in that last round. Boy, sharp two-punch combination by Manny Pacquiao. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by Manny Pacquiao. Well, his opponent got away from that uppercut. Great defense turning to offense for Manny Pacquiao right there. Blocked and punched back. Well, his
his opponent is opening up and coming forward, so I would think there are some opportunities that exist. Yeah, I think some counter-punching opportunities. Opportunities not on the front end, but on the back end. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Pacquiao's combination punching is working well here. Brings the left hand upstairs. Needs to improve. That's a big right hand there. Put him away. Oh, that was a smart move right there. He was hurt, but then he held on. Absolutely, Joe, but a stupid move, a bad move by the fighter who was having him hurt. He should have taken a little step back and not allowed him to grab. Didn't get it done going to the body there. He fires off the combination there and it lands. Pacquiao stunned here, and so are we. What a stunning turn of events. What's good for the goose is good for the ganta. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Manny Pacquiao. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. And we come to the end of the round. Well, he's up three rounds to zip on Teddy's scorecard here as we start round number four. He's a volume puncher, and that's exactly what he's doing to bank away these early rounds here, Teddy. Yeah, he's not hurting him with any of those shots, and quite honestly, a lot of them are missing. But the other guy's not staying up with him with the punch numbers. He's winning the rounds. Beat him in the punch! Good fundamental work, landing the one-two there. Pacquiao's making for a tough target there. He gets away from that punch. Comes right back with a shot of his own. Good step back counter punch there. Pacquiao's dealing with the aftermath of being rocked, but yet he hasn't changed anything. He's still sticking with that style. Well, that means panic has not set in. That's a good thing, Joe. He still believes he can get this thing done the way he came here to get it done. Teddy, is anything going to change at this point? He keeps getting hit by right hands. Probably not. Let's be honest, Joe. This is a habit. This is a flaw that was with him in the gym. And it's still with him now. It's not going to change. Pacquiao's showing you what it takes to be the best in this business. Good, crisp combos. Now you're seeing stamina right here. How can they possibly keep up this pace? Minute to go in this round, and they have been all out. I know how I feel, so myself. I mean, I feel like I've been on a roller coaster, except I'm not sitting, I'm standing. <laughs> Scores up top with a left. Commits to the straight right. Tried and true method that works out very well. The counterpunch landing by Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao able to land a huge uppercut. Pacquiao's dominating this fight every which way, just punishing his opponent. And his opponent has the face to show that result. Well, that's because all the punches that are being thrown, they're accurate punches, and they're all being thrown with bad intentions. Punches and bunches, combination up top. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao's ability to utilize this jab, fighting on the outside, has been so critical in what we've seen on the scorecard so far. Why so, Tim? Because it's not a common jab. You know, he reminds me, believe it or not, of Hector Camacho, the former junior lightweight champion, because he throws a trip hammer jab. You know, usually you turn that jab over, you know, counterclockwise, but he doesn't turn it over. He just drops it down. It just drops straight down. There's no warning, and boy, it's been landing. He was waiting for his opponent, just waiting for an opportunity, and he found it, the counterpunch by Manny Pacquiao. Nice work blocking that, and then an uppercut of his own. A little something for his opponent after getting tagged. Got to be accurate to send the combination to the body, and he does that. Not the most accurate uppercut you'll see. Good look at right hand after he got hit. Hey, you gotta see that come in. Let's 
little head hunting with the left. And right, left, and right. Just ate a big uppercut. He's in bad shape. Oh, that's gotta hurt. And he is down. He is down for the first time tonight. up after that punch put him down on the canvas now he needs to get on that bicycle and stay away from this guy and now the right hand lands because of the work done. oh and there you go well we know he survived earlier but now he goes down for a second time It's over. This fight is over. Manny Pacquiao's hand to be raised in victory. He scores the knockout here tonight.